beautiful day. Time for a ride. Awesome. All right, let's turn her on. Oh no, there's no power to the display. My 850C display has a problem. All right, I bet you it's the battery inside here that's used to hold the clock. So I'm going to show you a little trick to fix this display. Why don't we head into the workshop? So first, before we determine this is the cause of the problem, we of course have to check all our connections. Make sure our battery is actually working with the lights on the side and check all of our power connection plugs on the underneath side of the bike and the handlebars. If they're all good, then I'm fortunate enough to have a spare display that I can try to make sure that my diagnostic is correct. Unplug this and try another one. Okay, now when we try turning this on, action. So this one's working fine, our system is fine, apart from this display is not working. Just to double check. Still nothing from this display. So after we undo the mounting bracket, we can carefully remove the display from the bike and we will take it to the bench. I'll show you what to do next. There is a battery under here which holds the clock on this display. We need to access that and then short out the battery with the terminal at the bottom. So the first thing is to very carefully, don't go too far with this, Drill a hole just above where there's a little symbol for a rubbish bin. Can you see the battery in there? So we have access to the battery now. Then we use a small piece of um, conductive wire, uh, one end touching the battery and the other end touching the negative terminal here and hold it for five to ten seconds and that should have done the magic let's have a try we'll plug it back in carefully we'll give it a try yes success one of the clues that it, the battery was going flat was probably that the time wasn't staying set you know, in the back end settings here, two presses on the on button, we can go through to reset the clock here. But the key to making sure we can charge this internal battery is having the auto off function off and leaving this turned on overnight occasionally, once every three months or so. So your e-bike battery can charge the internal battery in here. So we can set this but we're going to leave it off and leave the system turned on overnight. Very important to avoid this happening again. And we can also go in and reset the clock. Maybe not right now. So now we just need to fill this hole that we've made up with silicon to ensure it's still water tight and we're good to go again. And give it a nice smooth over. Watertight now. Cool, got that sorted. Now let's just fix this up and get out there for a ride. I hope that's been helpful for you too. Uh, do like and subscribe if you like more content like this. Help you get out on your bike and have some fun.